Welcome to this MindView video tutorial introducing you to the calculation module and export to Microsoft Excel. This video tutorial is based on the fact that you already have a working understanding of the basic functionality of MindView. In this session I'm going to introduce you to how to add variables and equations using the calculation tool in MindView, how to summarize branches and how to export into Microsoft Excel. In this example we're generating a simple revenue forecast across four different countries with two territories within each territory. I've opened the calculation module here on the right hand side of the screen. The calculation module is a bit like having an Excel spreadsheet built into the mind map. It enables you to add custom data, add numerical and alphabetical data, and even add equations and summaries. In this example, I want to compare the difference between the actual revenue and the target revenue. So let's select Territory 1. Under Insert New, I'm going to type Budget. The next line down we're going to put actual and on the last item here we want to work out the difference. Now that I've named these different items we can start to add values and equations. So under the budget value we're going to put the value of the budget and the actual will be the actual revenue. Notice as I'm adding these values within the calculation module, it's automatically starting to display that data on the branch itself. Now finally, I want to calculate the difference between the budget and the actual revenue. To do this, we select once the value box and then select it again to bring up the functions functionality. Within here, we can start to calculate the budget minus the actual revenue and there displays our difference. Within the defaults function within the calculation module we can start to add currency. So in this example we're working in pounds so under the budget section I want to add the pound icon I can also affect my decimal places and the positioning of the currency icon. Within the defaults tab, it's also possible to add calculations that will be applied across the whole of the mind map. Applying it in here will speed up the process of calculating values. Here I've put on the exact calculation that I put on the individual branch. Now when we add values onto Territory 2 for the United States, we'll see that calculation happening automatically. Fast forwarding a little here, I've now added budgets and actual revenue across every single territory on this revenue forecast. Notice how it's automatically calculated the difference between those two values and applied the currency icon across those values as well. The hierarchy of the mind map allows us now to summarize or roll up the values of the outer branches to help define the individual countries and also the overall revenue forecast. To do this as an individual branch level, Firstly, select the branch, and instead of manually adding the values within the column, you can just select once, select twice, and choose to summarize the sub branches. Notice how it will then roll up the values from the outer branches to define the budget and difference of the parent branch. By adding the actual summary, we've completed the calculation for both those territories within this country. 
Just like before, you can add this calculation as a default within the default section of the calculation module. We've now successfully completed a visual overview of our revenue forecast with detailed information using the calculation values within that calculation module. To export this data over to Excel, firstly head to File, Export and select Microsoft Excel. By choosing the custom Excel export, you can choose from a range of different templates built into the software and choose between various different layouts and which data you'd like to include within the Excel spreadsheet. Here we have the completed export from the mind map to Microsoft Excel. You can see how it has structured the Excel document based on the hierarchy of the mind map and created custom columns relating to the values we attributed within the calculation module. In addition to that, Excel has created expand and collapse opportunities, again based on the structure of the mind map. Here we've managed to create a clear Excel document based on the information both from the mind map and the calculation module.